In this video, I'm going to show how to get the latitude and longitude for the temperature break from sea surface temperatures. So, for example, well, there's been a lot of bluefin caught recently off of uh, Oregon Inlet. And let's pull up and uh, we're going to do this from Oregon Inlet location. So, I pulled up Oregon Inlet. I can see my little red cursor here. I'll go ahead and I'm going to turn on the North Carolina sea surface temperatures. And if I zoom on out, I can see that there's a uh, image here with the sea surface temperatures. And what I'm going to do is drag my red pin down to where the break is. And it looks like there's a good place for the break right here. Here's the 120 line. I'm going to drop it right here on the 120 line. And if I pull this back so I can see the location, I can get the degree minutes, which is used for most of your GPS uh, units uh, for inputting. And uh, for international, there's a lot of different units that use the degree minutes and seconds. And then uh, most of your modern uh, equipment and maps all use the decimal. So they're all here. And as I move these, you can see that that latitude and longitude is changing. And I can find out pretty close within the hour where I need to be in order to find that break. 